Hello my loves, it's Maria, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here and you just found me. In this channel I read poetry and I'm also talking about other topics like musings, about life and such that interest me. So if you're interested in these topics, please consider subscribing to this channel and today I'm starting a brand new poetry reading series for my new book, The Beauty and the Gloom which is releasing in April 20th, 2024. I chose the same date as my previous book, Ethereal Dreams, which was released in April 20th, 2023, because I thought, you know, April 20th falls on a Saturday this year, and I thought that was nice. So I feel like I really enjoy, I really like um, April releases for my poetry books. So I'm gonna be reading 10 poems from this book as we wait for the release date. And you know, let me just talk a little bit about The Beauty and the Gloom. I know it's kind of a strange title. I took inspiration from Beauty and the Beast because there's a lot of fantasy poems and like love poems in this one. It sort of, I find that it sort of has the same vibe as Ephemeral, but with the addition of fantasy poems. And that's why I decided, you know, I want to have a book titled The Beauty and the Gloom. There's a lot of gloomy poems in there, dark and sort of sad poems in there. So that's why I chose that name. Actually, Ephemeral was gonna be titled The Beauty and the Gloom originally, and I had sort of been planning this ever since I decided I wanted to... Even before I decided I wanted to publish poetry, I thought to myself, I would compile these poems under the name The Beauty and the Gloom. Although originally I wanted to call it a hundred poems of light and darkness or something like that. But when I came up with the idea of the beauty and the gloom, I just thought it was a neat name. But I didn't have enough fantasy poems at the time when I published Ephemeral. So I thought to myself, I'm gonna wait until I have more fantasy poems to title a book, The Beauty and the Gloom. And the time is now. So today's poem is titled his heart in a box. His heart in a box. There once was a prince in a palace he kept his heart in a glass box. Wooden notes of a strident nature hung around his frozen heart, all the while his fingers ached to play a softer melody. Like a treasure he kept, the flower she gave him, hidden out of sight, there it would not dry, among the words he once wrote, the true voice of his heart. His heart not his, he held a sword and learned but one full dance, all the while his fingers ached to hold a lighter destiny. He drowned in pungent red. As his eyes fogged to the rest, he rode to battles which would not bear his name, no, they would not bear his name. Should he have turned away and seized with braver face the flower which he hid instead. That was his heart in a box, a poem included in my new collection, The Beauty and the Gloom, releasing April 20th, 2024. This poem was written in December 29, 2020. I have the poems printed out because I still don't have a physical copy of the book. I still have all the poems in my computer, so yes. When I have the physical copy, I'm making another video to show it to you guys. I think the cover is beautiful. I just show it to you. I designed it myself as I usually do, but this time I used a web-based program called Kittle, which is really good. And yes, I highly recommend it. If you enjoy creating designs and like creating your own book covers, it is great. So this is it for today. I hope you liked it and I will see you in my next one. Next Monday, we continue this series. Remember, I'm reading 10 poems. And yes, if you like The Beauty and the Gloom, you can pre-order it next week. So yes, for more details, I suggest you follow me on Instagram. I'm gonna write my Instagram name on the screen. There you can get updates on when my releases are coming. And also, I'm also a singer and a composer and Around May, I'm releasing my first originally produced song. It's called The Songstress. And I invite you to check it out. Check out my music channel, which will also be written on the screen or linked below with everything I've mentioned here. And yes, 
hope you liked it and I will see you in my next one. Bye.